Welcome back to Infigyan friends. In this very exciting and incredible video of system of equations where we are going to take up two equations simultaneously x over y plus y over x is equal to 25 over 12 x square minus y square is equal to 7. We have to find out x and y. I will demonstrate two different methods to solve this problem. Let me write here method number one and I will use domain means x comma y it cannot be equal to 0 as it is in the denominator. Done. Now I will give substitution straight away. Let me call this is our equation number 1 and this is equation number 2. So let us consider x over y equal to a or y over x is equal to 1 over a. So I will put here in the original equation number 1. So what I will write a plus 1 over a equal to 25 over 12. Multiply this with a. So I will write a square plus 1 equal to 25 over 12 a. Take this term to the LHS or before that we can multiply with 12 also. So I can write 12a square minus 25a plus 12 equal to 0. Now this is one quadratic equation. We will find using Sridharachar formula. Let us write a is equal to minus b. So 25 plus minus under the root b square minus 25 square 625 minus 4ac, a and c 12, 12 each. So 144 times 4, 576 divided by 2a. So 12 times 2, 24. So I can write this one as 25 plus minus square root 625 minus 576, 49 over 24. Now I will write a value and remember our substitution was x over y equal to a. We will use little later. a is equal to 25 plus minus 7 over 24. 25 plus minus square root 49 is 7 over 24. Once I will consider plus sign, I will write 32 over 24. Minus sign, I will write 18 over 24. Now we can cancel using C32, 8 4 the, so I will write 4, 3, 6, 3 the, 6, 4 the. So our conclusion is A is equal to 4 over 3, 3 over 4. And what was our A? A was our substitution x over y. This value was a. So I will write here x over y. So ultimately what is getting means what we are having right now. We are having again one system of equation which is more simple means x square minus y square is equal to 7. x over y is equal to 4 over 3. This is new system of equation which is quite simple one. And second equation is x square minus y square is equal to 7 and x over y is 3 over 4. Second value, this is one system of equation. Now we have, we will solve both the system of equations. So let me write here x square minus y square is equal to 7, x over y is 4 over 3. So from this equation, I will write y is equal to 3x over 4 done and this value I will substitute in the first equation. So I can write x square minus y square is 3x over 4 whole square equal to 7 or x square minus 9x square over 16 equal to 7. Take LCM. So I can write 16x square minus 9x square. So that will be 7x square over 16 is equal to 7. 7x square over 16 is equal to 7. 
so now we will cancel 7 7 conclusion is x square is equal to 16 so taking a square root both sides x is equal to plus minus 4 now remember our substitution was x over y let me write here we substituted x over y equal to a so i can consider from here the value of y and y was 3x over 4. So from here we can find out y value. I will write 3x over 4. Put the value of x. 3 over 4 times plus minus 4. So 4, 4 will be over. So answer will come out plus minus 3. So our first set of result is x comma y. It is equal to plus minus 4 comma plus minus 3 that means if it is plus 4 then y is plus 3 if it is minus 4 then y is minus 3 so two two solution set is there now we will take up the second system of equation let me write first it was x square minus y square is equal to 7 and second equation was x over y equal to 3 over 4. This was our second system of equation. Similar way, I will calculate the value of y from the second equation, from this equation. So, what is y from here? y will be equal to 4x over 3 this time. And this value I will substitute here. So, I can write x square minus 4x over 3 whole square equal to 7. In next step I can write x square minus 16x square over 9 equal to 7. Now this time 9x square minus 16x square that means minus 7x square over 9 equal to 7. Minus 7x square over 9 equal to 7. So I can cancel similar way. I will write here 1. So, x square is equal to minus 9 this time. And see this we will consider. A square is negative. So, complex solution is about to come. We can write this one as 3i whole square. Check. 3 square is 9. i square is minus 1. Left hand side is x square. Take a square root both sides. So, I will get to know x is equal to plus minus 3i. Now, what was our y conversion? So, let me write here y is equal to that value is 4x over 3. Let us put the value of x. 4 over 3 times x. x is plus minus 3i. So, I will cancel this 3 and 3. So, y value is coming out plus minus 4i. So, if you are calculating complex solutions also then you can write this one is the new set x comma y is equal to plus minus 3i comma plus minus 4i earlier it was x comma y is equal to plus minus 4 comma plus minus 3 so this is our solution complete solution now I will take up method number 2 and that method is using algebraic identity. Let me take up here method number 2. I will consider one identity. First of all I would write this equation as x square plus y square over xy equation number 1 equal to 25 over 12 done so conclusion is x square plus y square is 25 over 12 times xy second equation is as it is x square minus y square is 7 now first equation i simplified in this form x square plus y square is equal to 25 xy over 12 now i will use one algebraic identity which is very very important that is a plus b whole square. So let me write here x square plus y square whole square 
equal to x square minus y square whole square and then plus 4x square y square. Only need to put the values. See it is x square plus y square available. So I will write over there 25 over 12. Let me write here xy over 12 whole square. Right hand side x square minus y square which is our equation number 2. So let me write 7 square plus 4x square y square. Okay. Now I will expand it. Means take a square 625x square y square over 144. So let me write here 144 is equal to 49 plus 4x square y square. Now we will find out xy value from here. Let's take this 4x square y square to the left. So I will write 625 over 144 x square y square minus 4x square y square is equal to 49. Now if you will simplify LHS only, take x square y square common and simplify LHS only, we will be getting x square y square is equal to 144. That means xy is equal to plus minus 12. So again we will frame two system of equations. How it would be? Using x square minus, let me write here, minus y square is equal to 7 and first xy value that is plus 12. This is first system of equation and second system of equation would be x square minus y square is equal to 7 and xy is equal to negative 12 this time. See there are two values now. One is plus and another is minus. So two systems again we are having. Now simple task it is we will find out y value from the second equation. See y will be equal to 12 over x and we will put this value in the equation 1. So let us put x square minus y square will be 144 over x square equal to 7. Slowly x power 4 minus 7x square minus 144 equal to 0. Okay, this is quadratic in x square. We can say we have solved number of problems. This is quadratic without substitution. We can find out. So we will apply Sridharachar formula. So let, let us apply. Let me write here x power 4 minus 7x square minus 144 equal to 0. So this is quadratic. So I will write x square is equal to minus b 7 plus minus under the root b square. So 49 minus 4ac. So I will write plus 576 and divided by 2a. So divided by 2. So again I can write 7 plus minus 576 plus 49, 625. So let me write directly 25. Square root of 625 is 25 over 2. 7 plus 25, 32 over 2, 16. 7 minus 25 is minus 18 over 2, minus 9. Okay. Now take a square root both sides. Plus minus 4 and plus minus 3i. How it is? Minus 9, we will consider this one as 3i whole square. Okay, then you will take. Now come to the value of y. y is 12 over x. As per our substitution, it was 12 over x. So y value, once x is plus minus 4, then plus minus 3. And once x is plus minus 3i, then we will write plus minus 4i. Same solutions you are having. So I can write solutions. Let me write here x comma y. We can write it as plus minus 4 plus minus 3. It is plus minus 3. And second solution was, second set of solution was plus minus 3i comma plus minus 4i. So overall four solutions. 4 comma 3 minus 4 comma minus 3. 3i comma 4i minus 3i comma minus 4i. Now come to our second equation which was x square minus y square is equal to 7 and 
in this system of equation the second equation was x y is equal to minus 12. now if you will solve if you will solve in the same way then we will find out y value from here so minus 12 over x and once you will substitute this value into the main equation you will get same equations as we have solved so far this manner we will get y because of we are having y square here whether it is 12 over x it was our earlier substitution and this is our new substitution so once you will take y square it will become same same set of equations we will get let me write our final answer by the method number two in the complete order form so it will become or equal t we can write like this first set x is 4 y is 3 second set x is minus 4 then y is minus 3 third set x is 3i then y is 4i and fourth set is if x is minus 3i then y is minus 4i this is our complete solution real and complex i hope this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck and take care of yourself